Hello, my name is Tom Franti with the University of Nebraska-Lincoln Extension. I want to talk to you about designing your rain garden. A properly placed and constructed rain garden will capture the rainwater from your home downspout in the garden and infiltrate it into the soil where it will nurture plants. It will also prevent that water from going downstream to lakes or rivers and causing flooding and may capture some pollutants as well. The first step in designing your rain garden is choosing a location. You should choose a location in your yard at least 10 feet from your house building to avoid excessive water near the foundation. Also, we recommend not placing the garden more than 30 feet away from the house. You want to make sure the water from your downspout will drain directly to the rain garden. You may need to do this with a small swale in the ground or even an underground pipe. Other location considerations include avoiding any buried underground cables, electric wires or TV cables, and also not planting next to a tree. The roots from the tree will interfere with the plants in the garden. Also avoid shade from the tree or excessive shade. You can plant a garden in shade or in partial shade if you select shade tolerant plants for the garden. Just remember, don't plant a garden with sun loving plants if it's going to be in shade. Selecting your rain garden size and depth will be described in a different portion of this guide. Here we're illustrating the feature that holds the water in the, in the rain garden, the soil berm. This one's covered by mulch. The soil berm is like a, a feature, like a dam around the garden that holds the water in place like a bathtub. It's built about six to eight inches deep, made from the soil that you dig out when you're leveling the bottom of your rain garden. This holds your water in. There does need to be a place where the water can overflow the berm, called the outlet structure, if the garden does get too full. Finally, selecting the proper plants for your rain garden is important. Select plants that can have their roots wet for a few days to plant in the bottom of the rain garden where the water infiltrates. Select plants that need dry roots to plant along the berm itself where it drains well. Remember the shade issue. Do not plant sun loving plants in a garden that will receive a lot of shade or partial shade. Proper plant selection, proper garden placement, a level soil berm and garden bottom are the key design features for a successful rain garden.